Hi there. Later, the first out trans Paralympian on competing in the next Games. But first, same-sex marriage has been legalised in Thailand. The king has now endorsed a marriage equality bill that was passed by Parliament earlier this year. It comes into effect in January. Human rights advocate Mukdapa Yangyuan Pradhan tells ABC News Australia the message this sends is important. It's telling that you cannot just only see heterosexual couples now. There, there are couples of people of all genders in Thailand that you cannot neglect that they exist. It will also open up for more level of um, acceptance and less and less discrimination. This makes Thailand the first country in Southeast Asia to recognize same-sex marriage. The new law also provides adoption and inheritance rights. Conversion therapy has been banned in South Australia. It means anyone who tries to change or suppress a person's gender identity or sexuality could get five years in prison. There are also fines of up to $15,000. The Equality Australia organisation says it underlines queer people aren't broken and we don't need fixing. And the first ever out transgender athlete at the Paralympics is already thinking about the next Games. Italy's Valentina Petrillo reached the semis of the women's 400 metres earlier this month in Paris. The 50-year-old, who's visually impaired, says she hasn't yet reached her physical limit and she's now got her eye on the Los Angeles Paralympics in 2028, by which time I may finally have gotten around to cleaning the bathroom. Subscribe to Pride Daily so you never miss an episode. Sorry to give you admin. I'm Kev McGrath. See you tomorrow.